Hey, what's up guys? Tyler here with Tarver Cards and we are driving to buy a collection for $4,300. Hopefully we didn't get ripped off. Our pets' heads are falling off. But we're gonna, we're gonna see what we got. I'm gonna load it up, we got a trailer here. It's a big collection. A lot of football, a lot of basketball. And so hopefully, hopefully we made a good deal. We'll find out. But before we do that, hit him with that intro. By the way, shout out to Ezra on the camera. What's up, Ezra? How you living? We got Finn in the back. Holla at your boy, Finn. What's up, Finn's Finn? Yep. All right, say hi, Finn. Hi. Hi. All right. Back to me. What's up? Let's hit him with the intro, and then we're going to load it up, and then we'll show you some of the stuff we got, see if we made a good deal. Here we go. Guys, so my dad is outside right now loading boxes uh, from the cards and from the guy, and here. Hey, Ez, how you living? He is. There he is. Well, there's one box, so I'll see you later when he's loaded more. Okay, so here it is. There he is right there loading the boxes for like 4,000 something. Not 4,000, 400 something. Mm. I hope not 4,000. He'd be in trouble by my mom. There is a lot more to go, so see you later once there's a lot more. Two hours later. Just make sure that you don't spend all your money on cards unless you're giving it to somebody good okay so don't buy it from some cheapo or something like that okay that's good advice so my dad just loaded this all up and uh with all the cards and we're about to have to put it inside the car that was my dad loading up the <coughs> cards and we will see you once we get to the house so bye one eternity later guys it is officially not time but we did it look at this this whole thing is like three to four high with this stuff. Plus, we got all this. She's got the crazy eyes, dude. In here, this is stacked out. We got, this is way more. I like way underestimate. I was like, oh, it'll be like one row on the bottom here. Your boy was mad wrong. Not this time. It never happened. That's all cards. Binders, organized. There's some like where it's like the white boxes. Like, uh, let me show you. There's a lot like this but most of them are binders, organized, full sets. So we're gonna put it in this many storage so we have room for it. And uh, ladies and gentlemen, this is uh, this is quite the endeavor. So we are gonna, I'm gonna take a couple boxes home. Actually, they, the people that I bought it from, they live near me, but they all had all this further away. I'm driving to their house to pick up a bunch that came out because we had too much weight. And so this was touching the tire. And so we had to unload a bunch, put it in his car, and it was uh, it was a lot. So I'm gonna put all this in the storage, and then I'll open up some box for you guys. What do you need? We need a name for this this series. Maybe call it like collection something. By the way, we only lost one thing. This these two boxes fell off when I was a mile from here. I took the gas station. My kids needed snacks. Where do you wanna get a healthy snack, Rebecca? I want Chipotle. I said a healthy snack. Those fell off and crashed to the ground. We lost some Star Trek cards. Only thing I didn't pick up, rest in peace, Spock. He had a good run. Whoop, there it is. That's how lighting works. <laughs> hey, what's up gamers? Hey, all right, I'm gonna unload this and next thing you see should be us opening some boxes. Here we go. Okay, so I'm back at the house, got done loading everything in the mini storage and just got all this. Here's what I'm thinking. Okay, so I'm gonna throw this at you. Let me, let me set it up and then I'll, I'll throw it at you. Okay. So this is what I'm thinking we do. So, what's the plan? Right. Okay, so I'm gonna keep stuff for personal collection, but I'm gonna sell off a ton of it. And the idea is I put it on here on YouTube, put it on TikTok and Instagram, at Tarver Cards, holla at your boy. Jello Beats, uh, holla uh. at me. I'll stick it on eBay, like talk about it there, put it on eBay. People that, like if I'm selling a full binder, people that'll see the whole binder would be the people that follow on YouTube or Instagram or TikTok. Because I can't like take pictures, I think eBay limits you to 12 pictures. And so I'll put it on there so you guys get a first look at it. And uh, we'll go through all of the binders, see if we can find anything cool. Maybe we can hit some big ones. The big one. I think it's only appropriate if we, if I go grab, So this, 
This is full of binders. We're gonna go through them and let's uh, let's see what we got in here. See if we got any bangers. Straight bangers, y'all. Answer one simple question. Is it a banger? Okay. So we got them. Look at these. All right, so we're about to check these out. We're gonna look at them. We're gonna check this out. First one is Fleer Tradition Glossy NBA 2000, 2001. Okay, I'm trying to think. Who was a rookie in 2000, 2001? Let's, uh, let's take a gander while I'm flipping through. Oh, look at that. Sorry. Due respect to uh, your boy, Rookie Sensations, you know, Marcus Pfizer. Is that who that is? Oh my gosh. You guys, y'all gonna let me make this. There we go. Actually, what we're gonna do is I'm gonna search the set and I'm gonna see Fleer Tradition Glossy, see what the highest prices are, and that way we know what to pull. If there's a good card, we wanna toss it out. That way we can sell it individually. People don't always want the set. So let's see what we got. So Kobe's card is about seven or eight bucks. And that's about it. I don't see anything else that's sold recently. Yeah, we'll see if we find a Kobe in here. A little Kobage. Okay, Lamar Odom, Christian Leitner. Ain't nobody putting respect on his name. Uh, Mitch Richmond, Corliss Williamson. He's from Arkansas. I'm from Arkansas. What's up, Corliss? Saw him at uh, Best Buy one time. Took a picture with him and a girl that I was dating at the time. Um, Jim Jackson. Here we got Jalen Rose. Oh, little Stevie Nash. A little Stevie Nash, coach of the... That was Ray Allen in there. Sorry, I passed by him. Look at that. That's probably where that Kobe was. Probably where that Kobe was. He's gone. Rest in peace. Let's see. Byron. Remember that? Byron. TikTok. What do you want to tell Joe Byron right now? What's up, baby? Take me out to dinner. Hey, yo. Tim Hardaway. Beep -a -boo. Ron Artest. Wow. We looking through. We seeing if we see any players we like. I like our personal our PC. A little Shaquille O'Neal action. I'm trying to think 2000, like, who were the big, big players back then? Like, was MJ back? No, MJ was still retired, so Jordan won't be in here. Charles Oakley, I didn't know he played up into 2000. Goodness gracious. Ain't nobody telling me? Look, that one's missing. Don't know what that was. There's a little Dirkage. Is that Dirk's rookie year? Nope, third year. Played for the match. His rookie year would have been 98, 99. Sorry. Sorry, Dirk. That's a, this would be like, I love the look of this set, so that would be a sick year. To, uh, to have a rookie card. Um, let's see, got a few rando missing. That's not a good sign when there's some missing. That means somebody went through and took out the ones they wanted. Uh, Timmy Duncan, that was his fourth year. There's old Scotty Pip, Shaquille O'Neal. I would pull that out, but I wanna try to keep it in the set. Don't wanna take this from you guys, so. This whole set will be available on the eBay if you want it. Why am I talking like that? I don't know. That ain't on me, man, that's on you, fam. Okay, then we got a Rex Chapman. Is that an autograph? No, they all have that. And then back in the back, who's chilling in the back? We got a little uh, rookie card, Somalia Samaki, Donald Harvey, Dan Lange, and Eaton Thomas Thomas. Okay, so we'll put this off to the side, and then we're gonna look at this one. Who we got? This is a Topps 2000 NFL rookie cards. So uh, would this be, this wouldn't be, what was Brady's rookie year? When was Tom Brady's? Was it, if you're saying it, say it louder. I can't hear you. So let's search uh, Tom Brady rookie year. Tom Brady rookie year. Wasn't the issue with him that he was such a low, like they weren't looking at him, that um, how much? 2000. The year 2000. So this is his rookie year, but I don't think he had anything in this set, did he? Because he would have been like, he was so like low on the totem pole of people so, ooh, there's a Johnny Unitas, John Unitas. Look at that little page of Johnny Unitas. These are uh, Topps Archives. Been with me for a while, you know, we ran across a couple of those um, with a set we bought from somebody. Looking through here, don't see anybody crazy. If you guys see anybody cool in here, holla at your boy. Let's actually, let's look it up, see if he was in there. So, Kurt Warner, so he's in there. That's an insert. Uh, I guess Kurt Warner is the best card in here. Tim Raffey, you know, he's a goat. Let's search by highest price. Maybe that'll help. So highest price. Okay, there's Brady, but I don't think that was this set. Okay, so we rolling. I guess we're not looking for anybody crazy in here. Just rolling through this. this is a, I mean, this is a complete set. Complete set. I'm in such good condition too. These are in such good condition. Oh, something missing. I don't know who that was. 78, whoever that was in there. Okay, they've got them sort out. I was about to say they have them by teams, but they don't. Who is y'all's? There's Deion Sanders. I used to love me some Deion Sanders. I lived in Georgia back in uh, the mid 90s. So that's Steve Young. Um, so he, can you believe that 
Tom Brady's been playing since Steve Young was playing. I mean, that's that, that seems like a big deal to me. Is that a big deal to you guys? Um, I was playing, I'm sorry, I had a burp inside of my head. I was playing, uh, I say I was playing, I didn't play NFL or MB, in a, MLB, but I lived in Atlanta in the mid 90s. So that was whenever the, uh, the Atlanta Braves were like in their heyday. I know they just won a World Series recently, but they were going to the World Series like every year. They had like the dopest pitching squad on the planet back then. You ain't gonna tell me I'm off the screen? You ain't gonna tell me I'm off the screen? Um, back in the day. So I don't see anybody in here crazy. Um, Erlacher, NFL draft pick. So Brian Erlacher, rookie card. Maybe that's worth something. Rob Morris. Maybe he was so underlooked that nobody even gave him. Why couldn't he have been from Europe? He could have been in the Europe prospects. Look at the Bet Favre season highlights. Okay, I think we're good. All right, we're gonna stick the sucker up. It's missing a couple. We can say it's almost complete set in here. This is a weird one. Check this out. Look at this. These are like poker chip cards. So they, <laughs> look at this, this is wild, right? What year are these? 97 poker chip sports cards. Have you ever seen anything like this? I've got a set of these that I had. I just don't, like I'm looking at the names. So like you got a bunch of these, who was worth a lot back in the day. So the dude that had these, he was like super meticulous about like labeling everything. And so I can see, you know, which ones were worth the most. Like Dan Marino, he was 153, Emmett Smith, Brett Favre, um, Eddie George, and then Brett, Emmett, Dan Marino. So one, the 150s were the best ones. So let's see if we can find those chicken nuggets. It looks like he sold these at the show because you can see the prices on them. He was trying to sell them. So let's look for ones. Looks like the higher price ones, they bounced. Marvin Harrison. Okay, so that's the gist of that. I didn't see anybody crazy cool. Looks like all the ones that were priced were sold. So there's somebody sitting there with my chips. Just chilling. Okay, we got two more binders, then we'll call it a day. This is, says some rookies missing. This is 95, 96. So this would have been Kevin Garnett's rookie year, correct? Um, so look, somebody's missing. Probably Jordan. Probably old MJ. Total D. That's almost, nope. Okay, look at that. Jordan's missing right there. Come on, this binder getting squirrely and looking like looking like a unhealthy set of teeth out here. So we got these, I don't think, there's no Kobe rookies in here. It'd be Garnett's rookie year. But even Garnett rookies, they're not worth a ton, to be honest. I've got like the Garnett ultimate rookie and it's worth, what, 50 bucks graded. So, I mean, I think I have one of them listed. I kept one, listed. I listed the one with the coating. So even if I find that Garnett, it's like a $5 card. So we're not gonna spend the rest of your precious time and mine going through that. I am gonna list that. I do like these. Look at this. Like, I love these um, these books, like these notebooks. This one's kind of beat up, but I love those notebooks. I'm gonna go there. And then our last one, this is the most interesting. This is a complete set of comic ball. Comic ball, look at these. These are, look at the holograms. This is the complete set of, look, those are Jordans back there. It's, they did these like cartoon sets. Oh my goodness. There's a few missing, but it's almost, look at that. That is so beautiful. Like you can see King Kirby Jr. in there. My goodness, this is dope. I don't think any card is worth a ton out of this. Look at that, who's that? Oh, King Kirby Jr. looking clean. My goodness, and they have Looney Tunes on this side. Dude, this is cool. Look at that, it's Nolan Ryan, holograms. Man, I wish I had a reason to keep this set. Let's let's go over here. Let's do this. There we go. Now we have more room. Okay, we're gonna look back here at the Jordan section. Cause you know I like a Michael Jordan. But we're rolling through, look at this, Marvin the Martian. Look, you see the cartoon characters on the back. There's a football section. This is a monster set, you guys. And then back here, we've got Jordans. Jordan, Jordan, this, I think it's Reggie Jackson. Then you got Wayne Gretzky, Joe Montana. Then you've got the holograms. Then they are like hanging out on the set. My goodness, I probably am gonna keep this back part. Yeah, that's definitely going to my personal collection. I mean, I've got an MJ personal collection and this 
that's hard to beat. I'm keeping that part. The rest of it going for sale up on the channel. Okay, thank you guys. Uh, this has been, I'm not gonna lie, it's been a long day. Like moving a trailer worth of cards. I'm exhausted and I'm excited. Thank you guys for watching. I appreciate it. I hope this kicks off a series that we enjoy. And if I need to pivot, pivot! Making my way downtown, doing cards. Don't now, brown now. I'm sorry, I'm tired. Y'all be good, stay sweet. Like and subscribe, whatever. Do whatever you want, live your life. It's your life. Hey, yo.